Hey everybody, this is PJ Riley from Lancaster Archery here at the ATA Show 2018. I am at the Raven Crossbows booth with Justin Leesman. Raven Crossbows just hit it out of the park, changed everybody last year. It was awesome. Outdoor life, crossbow of the year. Justin, how do you improve on that? <laughs> well, we, we built on an awesome platform. So we've got the same dimensions that we had before. The, the bow's the same length, same width when it's cocked, six inches, ten and a half when it's when it's not. Um, the bow, the R20 this year is 430 feet per second, so it's a little bit faster than what we yeah. had with the R15 last year. Um, some other features are the the foregrip's a little bit different. We changed the safety. Let me turn around so you can see it here. So the safety is a little different than what we had oh, last yeah, year. Right. And then this particular model is our sniper package. So the sniper yes. package comes with the, uh, your elevation is adjustable with the jack plate. It comes with the Vortex Strike Eagle scope and the level up front. So you can make sure you're level for those long distance shots. And in case someone isn't familiar with the Raven, run through some of the, the like cocking features. What makes this bow different? So the, the, the way you cock the Raven is with the cocking handle, you would release the carriage, it attaches the string, cock it back, it will ratchet back or you can do it quietly. But the same thing is you can let that back down too. Yeah. So you can decock the bow with that as well. And one of the features of course is that this has no rail. Correct, the, the arrow is free floating. So you can see the string here is, is raised. It's not on the rail at all. So when you shoot, there's no resistance from the rail. The strings aren't riding on the rail. So there's none of that resistance at all in the, in the bow. So it proves to be more accurate without having those things there. And from what I recall, that's what this bow primarily was built for, was accuracy. Correct. Yeah, definitely accuracy. This, actually, the jack plate, you can take this top off and put a different ring on that you can take it out to 200 yards. 200 yards? 200 yards, <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's awesome. So hand me that, and let's talk about some other things new from Raven. Let's uh, grab this. Uh, now, this is not uh, people, hunters especially, always wanted a lighted knock. This is a version of that. Tell us what this is. So we do have the lighted knock, but it's a lighted arrow. So it comes all together in one piece. Uh, the, these arrows are weighted with the lighted knock, so they're going to be true to what their, their grain is, what their weight is. Right. So the, you can get replacement knocks for the lighted arrows, but they come in a pack of three with the arrows originally. Yeah, yeah. And I think you said 400 grains is what you guys shoot for. Correct. So to go over again, you can get replacement lighted knocks for the lighted arrows, but you can't put a lighted knock into a regular Raven arrow. Correct, correct, that's very correct. Well, I'm sure lots of hunters were, you probably heard from that as much as we did. Yeah, yeah, it was something everybody's looking for, for sure. So we're glad to finally come out. And they're gonna be available this spring, not quite available yet, but sometime this spring. Gotcha. And this case, this is really interesting looking. <laughs> also new is the hard case. So you can see that when we open it up here, got high density foam you can put a fully assembled bow in here so it can have the scope it can have the quiver it can have the crank everything can go in there let's set this in there I would go like this yep just like that and when you close it it closes over the scope and everything yep nice so it's perfect for travel keeps it protected all this stuff will be available on the website so you can go check it out there ravencrossbows.com Brand new stuff from Raven. Uh, didn't think it'd be possible from the top last year, but they did. If you've got any questions, you can visit us at LancasterArchery.com.